Well, hey, good morning, church family and friends. Thank you so much for joining us for this morning's installment of Morning Prayer. Uh, this morning is not like every other morning. This is Memorial Day morning. This is the morning we set aside in our country to honor those service members of our nation's military who have paid the ultimate sacrifice. They have given their lives in service for our freedom and for the defense of that freedom. Uh, perhaps you know someone, or perhaps you know a family member who knows someone, or a friend uh, that knows of a family member who has given their life in service for our freedom. Uh, we want to honor them this morning. We're not going to look at Charles Spurgeon. We will pray together, but we want to honor them and pay our respects, and in some sense, be able to communicate, uh, though it would be insufficient, uh, some way to say thank you. Now, I, what I want to do this morning is I want you to, to get to a place where you can get still and you can get quiet. Uh, perhaps you would want to stop this video and you would want to get somewhere where we can simply maybe get about 20 or 30 seconds of silence for you to thank God, uh, for you to remember our nation's fallen heroes, and for you to simply be able to pray and, and and intercede for a family. Uh, perhaps you don't know one. You can simply just pray for a family. Jesus knows who they are. So let me ask you to stop the video, get somewhere quiet, and then we'll pray together. Let's Let's have a moment of silence right now. Father, we pray that you would comfort families on this day who have lost loved ones on the battlefield. Lord, it's hard for us to express how grateful we are for them. Seems as though, Lord, anything we would do or say would be uh, insufficient and woefully lacking. But Lord, we do want to say thank you to them. God, would you give us the opportunity to somehow thank a family or thank a family member who has lost a loved one, lost a friend? And Lord, we pray for them today that your goodness and your grace would shine forth. That Lord, on this special day, that they would understand that you see them and that you have a perspective, Lord, around this family that was left behind in a way that they do not. So God, we lift them up to you, whoever they may be. Lord, families on our street, families in our church, families in our office, families in our schools that are hurting and that are grieving and that are remembering the loss of their loved one. Lord, would you bless our country today on this Memorial Day 2020? God, help us to have a right perspective on freedom on grace, and on your providential hand over our lives. In Jesus we pray. Amen. Amen. God bless you, church family. I hope and pray that you have a wonderful Monday, this Memorial Day 2020. God bless you.